Hello everybody, this is Tara at a Holiday Florida and um, I'm enjoying the rain right now. I'm doing everything I can to enjoy the rain right now so I figured I'd show it to you as well. Um, I've been really super busy and super excited and super pumped up about what my team has released in order to help me uh, make profits now while I build my legacy residual income. So excited about that. So if you're interested in learning about that, I'm going to put the link right below this video on YouTube and you know, you just go watch everything that Cedric has to say because when Cedric speaks, you probably should listen. So go ahead and, and watch that video. But right now I'm just going to talk for a little bit. I wanted to make sure I made my, my video. I haven't made a video in a couple of, maybe one or two days, maybe one day I missed. I'm not sure. I've been doing so many things, blogging and video and posting and webinars and woo! I lose track sometimes. Um, a real important thing, maybe uh, I need to get with somebody on this. Maybe somebody could teach me a little bit more is uh, organization, you know, schedule making, time skills and stuff like that. I try not to be too regimented on things like that for a really important reason. Not everyone in my in my team can run their business off of my schedule so and I've, I, I totally know how that feels to to um, have to try to schedule my entire business around someone else's time and uh, it's not cool because it's impossible to get people on the phone and help you out with things when you have questions so I you know I'm gonna have to figure out how to make a real flexible schedule something that can keep me in line and uh, get my my things done and if it gets taken off schedule a little bit it's okay I'm right back on track kind of thing so I guess list making would be the best. I used to write a lot of lists, and I haven't done that in a little bit. I've just been running, 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 you know. I'm worried about it later, and that's good because, you know, I really believe that you should act now and feel later for sure. We've been raining here every day for a few days, maybe a few weeks. And I'm just real happy that Florida, we don't flood like other places that if this kind of rain happened in my hometown or in upstate New York or there would be major problems major major flash flooding problems so I'm real blessed that I'm on top of limestone and sand for sure fill that water for water aquifer up <laughs> let's get that done but anyway let me see let me see I just wanted to be sure I reached out to you guys and let you know that I'm still I'm still working on getting Craig Stavosky on a uh, interview. He's a busy guy, man. Really busy guy. I really love him, and it's going to be awesome value for you guys to to listen in on him and what he says about um, wealth and money and currency and profits. And the guy knows his stuff, and I'm excited. So just keep your eyes out. You know, don't don't get fetched up about it, because that that's not the way to be. Just when it's time and we get together and make that interview, you are all going to know about it. For real. Um, if you sign up there for to, to watch that free video, Information with Cedric Harris, you'll be on my email list. I'll make sure I send the video or the interview to you immediately as soon as I, me and Craig pin down a time that we're both available. Um, for sure, keep your eye out for that. Anticipate it, but don't don't get hung up on it. We will get there. <coughs> Let me see. I don't know. What else I want to talk about? You know, let's get healthy. Let's get wealthy. Let's do it together. Let's have fun. Let's paint pictures. Oh, I'm in a 30-day art challenge. It's so much fun. It's so good to just sit back and get something artistic into your day. You know, I've been doing a lot of photography. I haven't been doing a lot of pen to paper or pencil to paper stuff because I've been so busy. But I really love photography and... Uh, Yesterday I was watching a show, and the computer, the, it just went crazy, and it just like, made these beautiful colors and this awesome design, and um, so I screen captured that and played with it a little bit, and it's, I mean, let's, let's have fun in this world, you know, get out there in the garden, dig in the garden, get your feet on the ground, barefooted, you know, pick up a pen, doodle a little bit, I mean, just do something that totally unwinds you. And, you know, do it at least for 15 minutes every day. And don't forget your meditation. Don't forget your, your six minutes of...
No, I'm not going to be quiet for six minutes. <laughs> I got you there, though. You thought so. Your healing codes, that takes six minutes, you know. So, so gather up 45 minutes a day and section them into little spots, whether you have to spread them out throughout the day or what, to, to get quiet, to enjoy some art, to meditate, to, you know, make some music. There's awesome music players that are free on the Internet that you can really... Make some jazzy tunes. I've made a couple I really love. Um, my last two videos, the, the intro music and the ending music is mine. It's, it's totally mine. How cool is that? Let's dance. You know, go out in the garden. Put your feet on the ground. I really... There's something electric about putting your feet on the ground. Especially lately. It's just been pretty intense outside. So I want you all to keep your head up. Keep your mind clear, stay aware, have no fear, and don't fall for any of the hype. There's so much crazy stuff going on. I glimpse that as, you know, in my news feed. I don't watch the regular news because I, I know better. I know I need to be sane, but I'm definitely informed. And uh, there's, there's certain things in the works right now going on that people are really trying to, to divide us. And we can't be divided without our consent. So keep your eyes on that. So I, I keep seeing people post things like, well, if I got to take a drug test to go to work, then you should take a drug test to get welfare. Well, you know what? That's poverty mentality because I tell you what, your job shouldn't be asking for any of your bodily fluids for you to come to work for a job that you can barely get paid for. Because I'm telling you, the people that are getting paid really good money on a job don't have to submit to those tests at all. Trust me. I know the president of, the, of Publix ain't getting tested. I, I certainly know that the the, uh, the owners of car dealerships, I mean, just stop falling for that shit, guys. Stop falling for that shit. If you need some help and you need to go get some food stamps and they want to ask you for your bodily fluids, refuse. Fuck it. You don't need it. What is this? I mean, and then if you if you got a job, you got a job, you're going to get paid, what, 10 12 15 20 an hour? And they're going to want to know what you're doing on your part time? On your own time? I You know, unless they start paying you for 24 hours a day at work? I don't think they have the right to have that kind of information. And I don't care what your, your idea about drug use is or anything like that. It's none of their fucking business. So stop having that poverty mentality. God damn it. That's a rant right there. Stop falling for the, the, the black and white thing. That's a bunch of shit. But trust me, when it all comes down, if there is such a thing as it all coming down, and some of you may believe it, some of you might not, we're all going in the same damn God trained shit. So relax. Calm down. Practice love and peace. Don't fall for the poverty shit. Don't do it. Don't do it. I make $100 a day and I don't leave. I'm going to give nobody nothing. I don't have to justify my part-time free time to nobody. It's not possible. There's no way. I'm a free human being. You're a free human being. And if, if you need a little bit of help and the government wants to pull your bodily fluids to get that help, you don't need that help that bad. I'm telling you right now, I know it's hard out there, folks. Trust me, I know. Don't You can't call any of that it's hard stuff on me because I know all about hard. Stop allowing them to, to demand this kind of thing from you. You're a free human being. You were born that way. Anything that goes against that, you should resist. Peace, love, happiness, day 11, 30-day video challenge. Let's get paid, guys. Bye.